All right, we just got a new 20 plus second teaser from Rockstar. I mean, this was completely out of the blue. I mean, nobody expected a teaser right after the previous teaser we all got. I mean, guys, I'm just like blown away looking at this teaser now. I mean, going about to the first clip, you know, without wasting any more time. So in the first clip itself, we can see the beach location and it's somewhat like a party area going on. You know, you can see all those tents and those, uh, what can I say, the beach atmosphere there, you know, just like the party scenes there. And for the next clip, we can actually see part of the, you know, the side segment of the mansion, the drug cartel boss. So that is the side view of that. And in the next clip, we can actually see the ocean view kind of a part of that big mansion, which we saw earlier on in the teaser. That is the green screen one. So pretty cool right there. That's a good view. The next clip you can actually see those, you know, I'm guessing these are like the wheat farms, you know, those drug farms and all. So that might be the case. I'm not entirely sure. It might be other stuff too. We can't actually, you know, make out from here. I mean, looking at the distance from here, you can actually see that the island is pretty big. Because take a look at the far end of the map. I mean, look at how big this island is. This is pretty, you know, insane on Rockstar terms. Like, this is the first time Rockstar is ever doing such a thing. I'm actually, you know, really excited and, and you know, I have my hopes high up in the sky right now with this DLC. So, going to the next clip, we can actually see the new party kind of an area where this, you know, this is where those dances and all the parties, those things that take place is this area. We'll be getting more onto this in a minute. And going to the next one we can actually see the docks area. Here you can see the you know parking places for the boats. This might be for the civilians, but looking at the crane at the back, it kind of you know makes sense for the drug cartel things, the drug business and all. And also take a look at the boat, guys. It actually has a machine gun in the front. So I'm guessing this is an upgradable version for the already in-game one. I'm not getting the name of this boat, but yeah, I mean, you know, somewhat of a naval DLC and this uh, drug cartel heist DLC, all of them are, you know, combined in this one. Why I say the naval DLC is because of the next clips where we see this uh, whole dock kind of an area with lots of cranes and lots of boats with those machine guns and all with the watchtower in the back. And more about this naval thing in just a minute as in the next clip, we actually see the airplane going and also supposedly the entrance of this island. I'm not sure, you know, just like a welcome board up there. But yeah, I mean, we also have a runway. So I'm guessing, you know, the access to this island will be through these airplanes or, you know, submarines or boats or ships. And right after that scene, we actually, you know, somewhat get a glimpse into the heist thing. As you can see, somewhat of a military kind of vehicles. The two pickup trucks you see here right now are the Patriots, the old school Patriots in the earlier games and all. So this is like the Hummer in real life. So this is just like a two-door version. And also we can see a new truck right on the left side of the screen too. So these are some of the glimpses for the heist. You know, that is my guess. And the next clip, you can actually see the interior of uh, some building in that uh, area. Going to the next one, we also have a glimpse of the party area. Yeah, this is just what I was talking about earlier on. You know, that is where, you know, these, uh, you know, the DJs and parties keep going on. So this area is particularly for that. And now with the major thing, you know, the next clip, you can actually see the GTA Online character controlling the missile launch deck or something you know, in the submarine. Yep, we are getting a damn submarine. And take a look at this, all these missiles, these are inside the submarine, guys. And right in the next clip, our GT Online character gets on that uh, looking thing. I'm not, I'm not getting the name for that at this present point, you know, excuse me for that, you know, kind of excited. So we don't get the exact terms that we, that we are looking for. So right after that, we actually get a glimpse of the submarine. This is actually moving one. So my best bet is that we'll be able to, you know, drive it around the map. That would be great because it would be it would really suck if it just you know stays at one place like the one we got in the doomsday heist. Pretty sure it's gonna be that. I'll be covering another point regarding this in just a minute. And after that, we get the release date of the heist DLC. That is December 15th, Tuesday. So there we have it. That is the DLC teaser which we got, like a 20 second, 25 second teaser trailer we got pretty intense and pretty crazy you know even in rockstar terms this was like never expected 
boy oh boy i mean absolutely it's welcome you know i just can't wait to try it out the kayo perico heist now finally let's get on with the some more of the details regarding this heist dlc guys they talk about the heist and the island the theme of the whole dlc in itself as being the world's most notorious drug dealer in gta online so you know you guys can expect a lot of you know hard missions you know difficulty is going to be over the top for this pretty sure on that and right after that they also talk about the island being one of the most secure private islands in the entire gt online world so like i said you all can expect a lot of resistance you know a lot of enemy ais this is going to be exciting and then you know one of the biggest thing that literally everyone has been asking rockstar for we can do this damn heist completely solo I mean oh my god there's been so many times you've been so frustrated in doing those old highs you know when players left or disconnected we were so pissed i mean this new dlc highs and all we can do them completely solo this is going to be epic guys i'm just blown away with this thing alone i mean i'm pretty sure it's going to be difficult too so yeah and also with the highs being in the new locations brand new approach to the highs design I mean technically these are all new stuff so GTA online right not like the traditional highs or anything like the doomsday or the casino highs so this is going to be completely new my expectations are high right now and finally they also talk about the new DJs coming to GTA online and also the radio stations having 100 plus new songs 100 freaking songs are being added to GTA online guys in just this DLC alone holy moly man that is freaking insane Oh my god. And and for the last part, we will be able to purchase the damn submarine. Yep, we all wanted to purchase the damn aircraft carrier, but I mean, we are getting to purchase something. So submarine is going to be the headquarters for the upcoming DLC, you know, the heist, all those parts. So this is going to be pretty crazy, guys. I hope you all, you know, got on the game, did the heist, you know, part of the 100 billion challenges and all. If you haven't, you know, racked in some money, then it's not too late. I think it is time for you all to just, you know, get on the game, start making some money or else you all will be, you know, regretting a lot. I'm pretty sure I can look forward to, you know, this DLC being one of the one of the costliest, you know, most expensive DLCs. because with all these things being added into GTA online oh my god i can't even say you know i'm actually you know out of words at this present point so you guys better be prepared for all this holy moly man and also yes i will be doing the broke to rich you know new character new game a uh, series of uh, videos i hope to you know release the first video tomorrow I'm not entirely sure, you know, I've got a lot of work, but I plan to do it, so make sure to stay tuned. If you like it, do drop the video like and also subscribe if you're new to the channel. Also get your friends to subscribe too. All right everyone, thank you all and have a good day.